What's going on guys? It's Blake today. I'm back with another video actually later today I already made some videos today, but right now I'm gonna be showing you guys the most hyped sneakers out right now that I I'm thankful to have in my collection. <clears throat> Getting a little sick, I believe. My voice is like a little off. But in case you guys didn't know already, you know I had to bring up the giveaway. If you didn't know about the giveaway, I'm giving away this red on red box logo 20th anniversary t-shirt, these Dead Sock Ultra Boosts, and a pair of blue Baby Shark shorts. And all you have to do, in case you're wondering like, Blake, how do I win one of those? How do I win any of those? Like maybe a couple if you get lucky. Click the link down below, the top link, all you have to do is subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, and follow somebody by the name of Subfed. All that info is down below. So with all that being said, let's get into today's video. And the first shoe I wanted to show you guys is the Fragment 1, Air Jordan 1, collaboration, Jordan with Fragment. It's like a clothing company, right? Fragment Design. I don't even know It's like even a designer company, we believe. Yeah, these go for about like two grand now, 1500 This is like one of my favorite Jordans. Yes, because I'm a hype beast. You know I'm a hype beast. But uh, yeah, these are just really, really crazy right now. These are like one of the most hyped ones on the market. And speaking about ones, I have a lot of pairs. I forgot I had these. I don't know. I got them like right when they came out, they were hyped and now like they don't really go for much, but I still like them. But yeah, Fragment, it's just like a really simple colorway. Blue with the white with the black, with the little stamp. That's what makes it so hyped. So yeah, continuing on with Jordans actually. Um, did want to talk to you guys about these. These have jumped a lot recently. This is the Shattered Backboard. Anyway, yeah, these have jumped a lot. These are the version ones, right? They've just jumped a lot to like seven eight hundred bucks now like everybody that i know like is trying to get like almost a thousand for these now it's really crazy because these were going for like 400 ish and now they're going for like a lot more the quality on these is just really really nice great colors for the fall so i'm gonna be wearing these a lot and then i'll leave this open because we gotta get a thumbnail another really really crazy jordan one the air jordan one satin in this yeah it's just satin colorway whatever uh, this is the royal pair all right guys so yeah this is the royal colorway and this is the bread colorway and I hope the camera works good because Jake's running the camera you know so I'm, I'm sorry if I if I if I cut your head yeah. off really really crazy these are numbered out of 700 these are numbered out of 500 that's pretty crazy it's just like a special edition Jordan 1 for like in case you didn't know so yeah next shoe Jordan Cause, cause fours. I've yet to wear these because I'm looking for a size swap. This is a size 11. I need a little bit smaller, like a 10 and a half, I'm thinking. So I'm either going to buy another pair and give these to my dad, or I'm going to size swap. I'm probably going to size swap because my dad would not wear these. There is a shoe that I do want to get my dad, and I'll show you guys later. But yeah, I don't think my dad would wear these. These are super crazy, though. The quality, it's ridiculous. Really, really can't go wrong. Yeah, cause is a... Uh, it's, not a it's not a brand. You got roasted for that. What is it? It's like an art thing, right? Am I, I'm sorry if I'm wrong, but it's like- Okay, yeah, so let's just go with the fact that Cause is like an art company, something like that. They had a collaboration with Jordan. Super hyped, super crazy quality. This is like probably top five, like most hyped Jordans along with the off-whites this year. And yeah, this is just such a beautiful shoe made to perfection. These go for about, okay, so these, these and the breads go for about 1500 each. That's like top market value. And then these are like 1200 right now. Next pair I wanted to show you guys, this is the Off-White One. Really, really crazy shoe. Um, collaboration Off-White Jordan 
you know? Like, you know how Complex does the Shoe of the Year thing? That could win it. I feel like that could win Shoe of the Year. Yeah, for, like, for sure. Like, it's so, like, different, but it's also, like, it's so, like, just unique, you know? Like, it's crazy. It has, like, a really high look. And, yeah, by the way, I did take my name off of here in case you were wondering. The quality on these is, it's pretty nice. Like, if you look at this, it's actually really interesting because it's, like, totally deconstructed. Like, it's just really, really, like, crazy. Like, a really, really, like, crazy quality shoe. Probably, like, one of the best quality shoes, like, we've seen this year. So, I believe uh, there were only four pop-ups across, like, the U.S. that got these. No. Maybe London, too, right? No, it was across, it was at every Nike lab. Uh -huh. In every city with a Nike lab. So, it's... Milan, London, Paris, and New York. Well, yeah, the resale on these is like two grand right now. You're hoping that like when the worldwide release comes out in like a, a month or a couple weeks, they're going to uh, go down a little bit in price. So yeah, the other thing I wanted to talk to you guys about, the human race Pharrells. I got all the colors except for blue and dead stock, almost dead stock, dead stock, dead stock. These are all going for like a thousand now. These are going for like 4,000. You hear about that? Really? Yeah, dude. No, I hadn't. Flight club. Boy, he's putting them on just for the video. Never gonna wear them ever again, JK. They're a little tight. They're so dirty. I need to clean these. Crap protect. Yeah, I just don't have time. I, I'm so busy with school. I, I, I need to find like one day though where I'm gonna clean all my stuff. Yeah, so all those Pharrells, they like totally jumped up in price. Now they're all going for like a thousand each. Dead sock, baby. Dead stock. You made a good decision. Yeah. Yeah. That's for sure. So yeah, I could probably sell these for like a thousand. Easy, right? Easily. The other shoe I wanted to show you guys is this pair of Gucci, just low top sneakers right here with the snakes on them. Hyped right now. Like everybody's trying to get this like specific shoe, like with the snakes or with like lines or the flame. I was gonna, like people were telling me to get the black ones with the black, with the flame. I saw them in person once and I just, they were like ugly. So. I don't know, but I really, really do like those. Obviously, 350s. These are all like hype, like V2s. I don't want to talk too much about them other than these. These have jumped up a lot in price. These have jumped up in price. They're going for like a thousand now. And these right here, turtle doves. I don't know, I just feel like these are like played out, dude. Being like totally honest, like I love these and all, but like so many people wear them now. Like some, like people. Honestly, like, you, honestly, I like those more than that. I just feel like too many people are wearing these. Yeah, that's there's why I so like the movie. fakes, and there's probably like people wearing fake ones that look like real ones. It's just like, I thought these were like going for three grand, but like everybody has them now. Mm -hmm. But they jumped up in price. It's like the first 350. Like so. everybody, I don't know. I just feel like they're played out. I obviously like, they, they are really, really like nice. And I, I do like them. They're like one of my favorite Yeezys. But I just feel like sort of got ruined, you know? All right, guys. So the last shoe I wanted to show you guys was this pair of Fear God Vans. I'm super lucky to be able to have uh, purchased a dead stock pair when the hype wasn't like super crazy. Cause I got these for like I think 550 or six in San Francisco sneaker con. You were at San Francisco, right? Oh, you weren't. Yeah, I got these there for like a like a decent price, and now they're going for like 1500. So it's crazy. So yeah, like such a beautiful shoe. This is like one of my favorite shoes of all time. They're coming out with like three or four. Let's just say daddy used to be the plug, but he doesn't want to plug no more. So we gotta, we gotta figure out ways to get new stuff. You feel me? So I'm gonna have to start selling stuff. Yeah, most of this stuff is always like retrievable, you know, but like it depends like if you want to pay four grand for those, like two grand for like a beat pair rather than like a pair like Jordan's right now where like people are trying to get rid of them. So yeah, like I don't want to sell like certain shoes but like selling these, like it's not that hard to get them back. So with all that being said, it's your boy Blake. I hope you enjoyed this video. I got a long school week ahead and then I got like a couple really, really busy weekends. I'm cooking up a new song. I promise you guys, I promise all my haters, this song is gonna be fire. I'm working so hard on it. We like picked out the perfect beat. Yeah, I'm practicing like the lyrics and the recordings every day so I can like feel confident with it and just like knock it out of the park. So yeah. If you're a hater, thank you very much, and uh, have a good day, and we're out of here. Peace. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, make sure to go check out my latest video in the middle of the screen, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.